Hey guys, Adam of AS Trains, and you're looking at my new Bachman Plus Southern Pacific Daylight number 4446. I recently purchased this off of eBay for $45. The shipping was 11.25, medium flat rate, expedited shipping. This locomotive came from Sparks, Nevada, and I have to say it's a really nice model. The only problem I have with it is that it's not number 4449, it's 4446. However, um, I cannot deny the fact that it's a smooth runner, it is really detailed, and it just looks nicer than the older Bachman models. For example, the the builder's plates, they're colored in, as on my older one, they're not. I actually took some yellow paint on my old one, and I applied it to the builder's plates. The horn... Uh, sorry, sorry about that darkness. The horn on this one has been colored. The one on my older model has not been colored. Well, I colored it in. And also, the drivers, you can't really see them, but these are black all the way around. On the 4449, however, it is, it's got that thin chrome rim. And... When I first got this, I had to do a bit of work on it. I had to re-glue the uh, faceplate back on because it had fallen off during shipping, which it was no problem. And the wheels were a bit crazed, but however, uh, with the Plus models, instead of the round uh, tubes, it's got bigger tubes with square, uh, with squares on them. So it's different, and it also keeps the wheels aligned. On the bottom, there's no traction tires. It's this thing is extremely heavy to the point where what's the point of putting a uh, traction tires on the wheels so Bachman did not put traction tires on these plus models they just kept they just kept the metal wheel on the older models the geared wheel or the gear tube was back here on this model it's on the second to last I added a coupler on the tail end because when I first got this model it did not have a coupler I checked the box there's nothing so without further ado, I'm going to fire this puppy up and you'll get to see her in action. Enjoy guys. Oh, and one more thing while I'm running this. This engine did come with a smoke unit, but it was falling apart. Plus, I heard, uh, or I read somebody's comment that those things are highly dangerous and they can actually melt the front of your locomotive. So I took it out and I threw it away. There's this one, I don't know if he's a jet, if he's a full grown man or if he's a kid about my age or so, but he has a, a pretty nice HO layout. In fact, he even has the Bachman Plus uh, 4446. And to those that probably watched this video, it's the video that featured this engine with some passenger cars as well as a Lionel HO scale 464 Hudson. And they were running to the music of Chattanooga Choo Choo by Glenn Miller. And actually, on the second video he, the the person did, it was uh, highlighting the smoke unit on the engine. It was a uh, really, it was really pouring it out. And uh, in the comments, that's where I saw, that's where I saw the comment that read, you know, the smoke unit, if you're not careful, can melt the front of the locomotive. So, anyways, I'm gonna do one more back and forth running session, then I will finish this video. A bit jerky. I probably might need to clean the wheels, but I think I might need to clean this track as well because I haven't cleaned it in a while. Also, my old daylight, I am going to get it back up and running, but this one is going to do the dirty work. While my older one is going to be semi-retired. Uh, it is going to run. I'm going to make sure of that, but it, when I first get it home, chances are it's going to go on the shelf. So anyways, that was my new Bachman Plus Daylight number 4446 in action. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I absolutely love this new engine. Uh, the, like I said, the only problem I have with it, well, it's really not even a problem, is the number. It's not 4449. But the good part about that number is, is that I also have another road, no road number. It, it doesn't have to be just a 4449. I also got to remember that it would be nice if I did branch out into different road, road numbers. For example, like this one. 4446, 4449. That's, that's uh, pretty good. So anyways, once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Rate, 
comment, and if you want to, subscribe. That's it for now. I'm Adam Swindell, and I'll see you next time.